everyone. Today's topic is highest common factor HCF. Okay. Last class you studied about the prime factorization. So the same prime factorization here also you needed to use to find the HCF. HCF means highest common factor of two or more given numbers is the highest of their common factors. Okay. So how to find out the HCF of two or more numbers? So for that we can take uh, three numbers. 20, 20, 28 and 36. So these three numbers HCF we are going to find out. So all these numbers prime factorization you can write a first term. That already you studied. So here we want to take 2 because it is an even number. So 10 times 2 is the again 2. So 5, 2 5s are 10. Then 5, the next number is 1. This is the prime factorization of 20. Then 28. 28 also an even number. So we can start with the 2. How many times are there it is? 14 times. Then again it is an even number. So we can take 2. 2 7s are 14. Again 7. Then 1. At last you will get a 1. Up to that you want to do the prime factorization. 36 also an even number. So 2 we can take a 2 18s are 36. 2 9s are 9 is an odd number. So which number we want to write here? 3. 3 3 is a 9. Again 3. 1. Okay. So these are the prime factorization of 20, 28 and 36. Now we can write this as the product. Okay. So 20 equal to 2 into 2 into 5. 2 into 2 into 5. 28. We can write 2 into 2 into 7. 36. 2 into, this way we are writing, 2 into 3 into 3. These are the products, is it? Next we need to find out what are the common number here, common factor. Okay, so all the three numbers, what are the common numbers? This 2 is common now here. So we can write them. We can take this. This 2's are common. Then one more 2 is common. Is it a here also? So this also we can draw like this. So all the 3 numbers. This 2 is common and this 2 also common. This is the common factor. So HCF of 20, 28, 36 is just multiply these common factors. Here 1, 2 is common and here also 1, 2 is common. So 2, 2 is 4. 4 is the HCF of 20, 28 and 36. Clear? Next question. Find the HCF of 18 and 48. HCF of 18 and 48. Okay. The same method here also we can follow. 18. Prime factorization. It is an even number. So 2. 2 9s are 18. It is an odd number. So 3. 3 3 is are 9. Again 3. It is 1. Okay. Then 48 is an even number. So we can take 2 here. 24 times 2 are the Again 2, then 12 times other, then 2, 6 times 2, 3 is 6, 3, 1. Okay, this is the prime factorization of 18 and 48. Now we can write this as the product of prime factors. 18 equal to 2 into 3 into 3. 48 equal to 2 into 2 into 2 into 2 into 3. Is it there? 
Then now we can circle the common factors. So this two is common here. So we can draw like this. This two is common. Then one three here and one three here also. So this also common. Is it that? So what is the HCF of these two numbers? Just multiply these two. So two into three. So HCF is six. Okay. Next question. Find the HCF of twenty-seven and sixty-three. HCF of twenty-seven, sixty-three. Okay. So twenty-seven. Twenty-seven. All of you know it is a odd number. So two is not possible. So next we can take a three. How many threes are here? Three nines are twenty-seven. Again three. Three threes are nine. Three. One. Is it done? This is the prime factorization of twenty-seven. Next number is sixty-three. Sixty-three also an odd number. And uh, uh, check the divisibility by three. Six plus three equal to nine. Nine is a multiple of three. So we can divide by three. How many times? Uh, six uh, three two times and uh, three three one times. So twenty-one times are there. Again, twenty-one is an odd number. So we can take a three itself. How many threes are here? Three sevens are twenty-one. So next, what is the number seven? Seven is a prime number, so that is seven itself. Here also you want to write. Okay. So seven seven one here. Okay. Now we can write this as the product. Twenty seven equal to three into three into three. Sixty three we can write as three into three into seven. Now circle the common numbers. This three is common. One more three is common. So these are the common factors. So HCF equal to three from this one three and here also one three. Three threes are nine. So this is the HCF of twenty-seven and sixty-three. I hope all of you understood well how to find out the HCF of two or more numbers. Practice more questions like this. Thank you.